missing mother, Tequila Hayes, might be one step closer to finding closure more than six months after her disappearance. Today, Hayes' husband, Carl Hayes, was arrested for second-degree murder and tampering with evidence in her presumed death. Local 24 News reporter Caitlin McCarthy is live in the studio this evening after speaking with her mother. Caitlin? Well, good evening, Katina. Carl Hayes is behind bars on $2 million bond. I've been speaking with Tequila Hayes' mother, Roberta Nettle, since she was reported missing in August. Today was the first time I saw a glimmer of hope in Nettle as she sees this could finally mean justice for her daughter. I said, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. He's where he needs to be. It's been a hellish nightmare for Roberta Nettle as she has fought for justice for her daughter, Tequila Hayes. She's been missing since May, and her husband, Carl Hayes, was the last person to see her. He told her family she left with another man. My daughter, Tequila, she wouldn't have never given up on me. Now Carl Hayes is behind bars. Without a body, it appears investigators have been building a case for months. According to a search warrant filed this summer, Carl Hayes had replaced the carpet in their Cordova home, and Tequila's car had been thoroughly Really cleaned. Nettle's prayer now is that she can finally put her daughter to rest. I want him to just man up, give me her body so I can give my daughter a proper burial. Watching the man she believes killed her daughter get arrested and taken to jail brought a sigh of relief. Like I said, if God had to give the, this battle to me, he gave it to the right one because I'm going to fight until the end. She says this is only the beginning of the end of her nightmare. When the judge hits the table and say guilty, this when justice will be served. Nettle also wants to tell victims of domestic violence to not be afraid of speaking up and getting help. If you or your loved one needs help, the National Domestic Violence Hotline is 1-800-799-7233. Live in the studio, Caitlin McCarthy, Local 24 News.